Hello, my name is Mark and welcome to the channel It's All About Racing. The goal of my channel basically is to introduce you to all sorts of different model cars from different manufacturers. This particular car is a LookSmart Ferrari. Uh, this is a 488 GT3. This has what I think is the most gorgeous livery, the sky livery. Basically a plain white with blends of purple, pink, and orange. I mean, it is absolutely stunning. If you are not familiar with Look Smart cars, Look Smart cars are resin models. They are sealed. Uh, they come on plastic bases. They have these very attractive aluminum tags you can see on the front that identify the car, uh, the race that this particular car was competed in, and the livery from which was taken. Uh, they tend to be among the pricier 143 scar cars. I call them almost in the unaffordable area as they tend to run for about $100 to $150. However, I, as I had mentioned in other videos, deals can be found on those. In fact, I found a really very nice-looking silver Vista Sport car for $85 on eBay. And I think that included shipping. Um, so something to look for. Anyhow, let's take a closer look at this car. One of the nice things about the about the Ferrari 488 is, and particularly about LookSmart in particular, is the absolutely incredible detail and just just the shape of the car. I think the Ferrari 488 may very well be the sexiest car on the market uh, today competing in the series. Now, of course, this has just been replaced in 2023 with the 296, which is very, very nice looking. But the 296 eliminates the uh, the open engine base, so you can no longer see the engine of the car. So I stand with this as being the sexiest Ferrari available. This being a look smart car, the attention to detail is absolutely second to none. Spark runs a close second, but even Spark, uh, I don't think, is as good as look smart are. You never find a flaw or a problem with virtually any look smart car that I've ever bought. Because these are resin sealed models and they do have a whole slew of tiny little uh, you know, plastic parts and appendages, they are extremely fragile, maybe more so than any other model car you get just because of the attention to detail. So you have to be very careful in how you manage it. If you take, you know, the first thing I usually look at when I'm looking at a car are the wheels. And if you take a look at the, at the, at this car, they're beautiful. Pearly P0s, uh, you can clearly see the brake rotor, the slotted brake rotor, the Brembo brakes behind it. Try to get a little bit closer. There you go. Um, and, you know, the, this one has identified the right side cars, front and rear, by the yellow uh, strips that they have put on the spokes. As you'll notice on the, other car, so on the other side of the car, the colors are slightly different. You know, again, it's all about attention to detail. If you take a look at the, 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 uh, the sheen to this car, um, you know, they're, they're, they're painted well. The tampo graphics are exceptional. The decals they put on them are just absolutely amazing. I mean, look at that, the interior of that cabin in the cockpit. I mean, it is absolutely stunning, folks. And I wish I could show you more of the cockpit. You really need to shine a light in there and kind of look at it with a magnifying glass almost to see the detail. But I can assure you the steering wheel, the console, the computer, uh, you know, screens are just absolutely gorgeous in these cars. Uh, this car is a Pro-Am entry, is a Pro-Am entry, and competed in the 24 Hours of Spa in 2021. Uh, Chris Froggart, Eddie Cheever, I believe it's Jason Herr, and Michelle Cassoni were the drivers of this particular car. 24-hour race, so they do have four drivers uh, in it. If you take a look at the front of the car, again, one of the nice things about these Look Smart cars, I absolutely love the badges, uh, on the front of it, they identify the car. They tell you what race it competed in, and of course, this is has a Ferrari logo and Look Smart car. And Look Smart is about the only company today that you can find Ferraris. If you want a Ferrari 488, Look Smart's about your only uh, about the only g player in the game uh, because I think they almost have exclusive rights to Ferrari at this time. There are some very cheap Baragos that have Ferrari, and I even saw a uh, a, 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 a uh, IXO model that was Ferrari, um, but none of them are going to touch look smart when it comes to just, I mean, just, just look at this car. It's gorgeous. That carbon fiber front splitter, the supports, look at the way the paint blends along the nose of the car, the fog lights, the headlights, the tail hook with the little, believe it or not, that is a little tiny strap attached to the tail hook. Um, you know, they didn't have to do that, but they do. It's just really cool. Uh, the other thing you'll notice here too, um, Along the front of the car, you see those little tiny loops where it says E on the hood. 
Those are emergency pull straps to activate the fire extinguisher in the engine compartment in case there's a fire and the driver is capacitated and can't do anything about it. And this is a mid-engine car, and we'll look at that in just a moment because that detail is exceptional. But these are little tiny things that you get. Look at the mirrors, the carbon fiber finish, absolutely beautiful. Take a look at the top of the car. You can see this guy pro enter, and you, you see the antenna array. I mean, it's it's absolutely neat. It's it, it it's virtually true to every detail. The Fanatec window banner, the uh, the little window tear stri strips that you have on each side. And let's just take a look at the car from the top, looking down. There we go. I mean, that thing is absolutely beautiful. What a pretty car. I mean, I just. I think it's stunning and white with the uh, with the colors that you have. Now we're going to take a closer look at the engine bay uh, because, quite frankly, it deserves it. It's one of the highlights of this car. And there you go, folks. Take a look at that. I, you know, it really doesn't do it. Uh, again, a light, you know, is, is really needed to, to see. But you can clearly see the radiators. You see the hoses going into all the electrical. Uh, uh, Components, you know, uh, on on the top of the uh, of the, of the window. Look at the carbon fiber uh, on the side of it. I mean, just absolutely beautiful. The rear wing, you can see, is gorgeous in carbon fiber with a sky logo on it. Absolutely stunning. Take a look now. The back of these cars is something to truly enjoy and admire because they are beautiful. The Ferrari 4080 has one of the coolest, biggest splitters. Uh, may, maybe, I'm sorry, um, rear diffusers you'll find on any car except maybe the Porsche 911. These are GTLM spec, you know, so they are exceptionally large, but the carbon fiber finish on there is, is beautiful. I mean, look at those, uh, the, the, the cool uh, um, exhaust uh, tips, the tow hook, you see the yellow arrow pointing to it, Pro-Am entry, that little tiny yellow uh, tab that you see over by the, um, by the taillight. That is the emergency pull uh, strap for the air jack. Uh, so if for some reason when they detach the air jack for the car and the car doesn't lower it to the ground like it's supposed to, they pull on that tab and it lowers it. Kind of like the emergency switch you saw for the fire extinguisher in the back. The diffuser, if you take a look at the side of it, I mean, look at it, how it's straighted, the support struts. I mean, every little detail is there. It is absolutely stunning. The, gill, the grill work are gorgeous on these cars. And for 110 to 150 bucks, you kind of expect that, and you should. The passenger side is really not much different than the driver's side, other than the fact that you have the uh, the fuel tank. Now, notice the uh, the colors on the wheels on the passenger side of the car are red as opposed to yellow on the other. That helps the team members identify which side of the car to apply the wheels to. Yeah, it's a simple thing, but a clever thing. They do it. You can clearly see the dive planes, and even a better view from this side of the tow hook and the strap on the nose of the car, and I'll kind of just zoom in on that a little bit. You can clearly see that strap stricken way out there. Uh, that is attached to a little hook. Interior detail, again, is kind of hard to see uh, with these, but but trust me when I, when I tell you that it's absolutely beautiful. Look at the carbon fiber trim around the window panel. I mean, you know, these are little things that look smart, does really well, that a lot of other cars don't. The, um, the side rails, I mean, beautiful in carbon fiber. I mean, just absolutely nicely done. An exceptional car, folks. Uh, if you like Ferraris, you're going to love these cars. If you get a chance to get your hands on one, I certainly recommend it. Anyhow, that's it for this particular video. Hope you have enjoyed it. Take care.